One of the important parts of the Chumash culture that's represented in this museum is in this display cabinet. And in this cabinet we have, in the top shelf here, we have steatite kamals. And the kamals were used for uh, baking food and uh, acorn mush and things like that into cakes that would be consumed by the Native Americans, both during the mission period and pre-mission period. And these items are particularly important because they, were, they originally were uh, come from the island of Catalina and the steatite deposits that were found there. And then they were traded by the Tonga Indians to the Chumash, and, so, and that's how they came into this. this. This tells you about the trade networks that were in place before the Spanish arrived here. It talks about the vibrant types of inner communities and intercultural relationships that the Chumash had with other groups, and what a, a network of people that, that, that actually existed here. These just weren't simple pastoral people walking through the hills and things like this. They had sophisticated networks of, of commerce and with trade and with medicine and things like that. And some of those artifacts, like the Kamals that are present in this collection. We also have down in the second shelf, we have all of these uh, shell beads that were, the Chumash used as their currency. And they use this to purchase things like the steatite from the Tongva. And these were able to, uh, were part of their actual currency for trade and things like this. And the, we have thousands of the shell beads that were present during the mission period that are available for you to look at on this site. And then there are the various tools and things, the tarring pebbles that they used to make their version of the water bottle was to make a basket, line the inside of the basket with asphaltum or tar, and then that would waterproof it so that they could take water to different locations. This gave them mobility so that they go where fresh water didn't exist. It gave them the ability to trade long distances and such. So this is a place to come and get insight into that culture. Please come to the museum and enjoy your history.